Hey, what's up, guys? It's Crazy Wing from Guided Hacking. Uh, today, I'm releasing my hack tool uh, program, whatever you want to call it. It's uh, basically only has one function right now, and that's a multi-level pointer store. Uh, it's basically just an organizer to organize uh, your notes uh, for multi-level pointers or uh, just pointers in general. Um, so, again, if you're watching this on YouTube, this was intended for guided hacking forums, uh, so check that out, link in the description, the download will be there, and all updates made to this program will also be there. Uh, it's a great forums, uh, got a lot of friendly people on, it's a great place to learn how to hack from a very beginner to, uh, we're getting some really advanced stuff going on, and, uh, you know, it's a great community, and, uh, we're almost at a thousand members, I think we're at 960 something. So if you guys could help us hit that 1,000 mark, that'd be pretty cool. So uh, back to this, uh, I'm gonna open this up. And so, like I said, right now we, there's only one feature, and that's the multi-level pointer store. Um, I'm gonna add a hex calculator and uh, other hacking tools that will make uh, hacking in general easier. Um, so I'll open this up. And uh, like I said, I made this to uh, organize uh, your notes for your multi-level pointers. Um, for me, whenever I'm like working in a game, uh, getting addresses, I'm just writing them down in Notepad really quick, copying and pasting from Cheat Engine, putting them over there, putting down all the pointers, and then, you know, sometimes I realize, oh crap, this was the wrong pointer, I need to go back to, but I have no idea what back to is because they're just all over the place. So, I don't know if you guys are that sloppy with your notes, but I am, so I made this, and it's just a basic organizer, and uh, it's not functioning completely as I would uh, like it to, but I'm going to continually update it, um, but it's in, a, it's in a decent state right now. So uh, we start off by naming our section, so we'll say it's uh, health addresses. Uh, so we come in, we say our first address is 02556CA. And then our second address is uh, 012532AB. Uh, and we say, oh, this was only a one level pointer. Uh, this is static, and this is the uh, end address of our health addresses. So uh, then we come down here, click on our health addresses, uh, and click save. And this will save it into a tree. And uh, it tells you your first address right here and your second address. Now, basically, if you look here, um, this address is blue, and all that means, I'm going to add in like a color code thing, a button here that tells you what colors are what, but blue means that it is both a static and it is the end address. Um, so if it was uh, just the end address, it would be red if it wasn't static as well, and if it was just static, it would be green. So here, let me redo it to show you the green one. So health addresses, and I just randomly type some stuff in here. And let's say static, and this one isn't static, I know it doesn't make sense, but just to show you guys. Um, so this one is static, so it's green, and uh, this is the end address, so it's red. Now say, okay, so we've got our end address, we're done with health, uh, now we need ammo. Uh, so we click our plus button, and we need ammo addresses. First address, yada yada yada, second, oops, second. Blah, blah, I'm not even doing the right size numbers here, whatever. And then we realize, oh, it's deeper than three. It's deeper than three pointers, so click the plus, we had three more. Uh, we keep going with this, A, B, C, and then we finally get to our last address. And uh, this one is static, and uh, it is the end, so we click our ammo addresses, and we save it, and uh, there we go. We have our first address, our second address, our third, fourth, and our fifth final address is blue. Um, so yeah, that's basically it, and, uh, so this way you can really just have your, um, multi-level pointers, uh, stored very easily, and you can see the values, uh, very easily. One thing I did forget to include in this was offsets, um, I knew I was forgetting something, um, just, <laughs> it actually just barely came in my mind just now that I don't have offsets, um. <laughs> I'm going to release this anyways because I've recorded the video, but uh, I'm going to be updating that right now. So this will include offsets as well. Um, and that's basically it. And also, right now you can only have two different addresses. If we try and add another one, it just Fs everything up, see? Um, so, yeah. 
Anyway, I'm going to be updating this constantly, and uh, of course, if you watch this video all the way through and you're still on YouTube, um, which I don't know why you would be, but if you are guided hacking forums, check them out, link in the description, come join the community. Alright, see you.